Hello, guys. Welcome back to the Yearstar Technical Channel. Today, our topic is how to decrypt SIP and RTP from HTTPS or TLS when you make a call on web phone built on WebRTC. So I will use the Linker's web client to demonstrate how I decrypted these streams. But this method works for almost all web phones built on WebRTC. So with that said, let's get started. So here I prepared two accounts, Chris and Gavin. When you make call and experience some call related issues, naturally you want to capture a PCAP file and use Wireshark to check the SIP flow and the RTP streams. But when you open this PCAP and the SIP, you can only see some option requests and some 200 OKs, while the call flow seems disappeared. Enter RTP, nothing pops up. Because on web phone, developer will use HTTPS and TLS to encrypt SIP. All SIP is ciphertext. So even if you capture the PCAP, you can't see the SIP signaling flow. And for RTP stream, RTP is based on UDP, that's all we know. So we can find out the RTP part of PBX and different endpoints, then decode UDP streams on the specific part as RTP stream. Okay, so in order to find out the RTP part, first we need to check the SDP in the invite and 200 OK. Since we can't get this information in Wireshark, we have to use the developer tool on Chrome. Before that, remember to turn the capture tool on. So open the developer tool, click network, and refresh the browsers. Uh, after that, choose WS. You can see some SIP messages here. Now we make a test call. So here we dial from Chris. You can see the invite, the 100 trying, the 180 ringing. Then we pick up on Gavin's side. 200 OK pops up, which means the call has been established. After a while, we hand up the call. So first on Chris' side, since this call is start from Chris, so it will send an invite with SDP. Click send, enter invite. Scroll down to M line. Then we know the RTP port number of this extension. Uh, take it down, click receive, enter 200 OK. So this is a 200 OK with SDP sent by SIP Prosec, which is our PBX. So we know the RTP port on PBX. Go to Gavin's side, click receive, enter invite again. Get another RTP port on PBX. Then click send and the 200 OK, get the last RTP port number of this extension. At this moment, we have collected all the information we need. Stop the capture tour on PBX and download the PCAP file. Open it with Wireshark. Click Analyze. Click Decode as. Add four lines here, each line for each RTP part. So enter the port numbers we checked out just now. And choose the current to RTP. Click OK. Then when you enter RTP again, you can see the RTP stream list out here. Again, you open Telephony, RTP, RTP streams. You can analyze the RTP stream and check the voice quality. Okay, so that's what we have today. If you like our video, don't forget to subscribe to the Year's Star Technical channel. I will see you in the next one.